I've been lucky, Jack. I've had some. I've worked on some amazing shows and shows that have had like global, you know, global franchises. Sure. But Big Brother is a super brand. It's what they consider to be like the big daddy of all of those reality it's shows forever. This this brand. And there's been so much interest in this particular reincarnation, this reimagination of Big Brother in 2020. Like, I've got like five pages of radio interviews to do. It's oh, amazing. God. Can't yeah. you just chop this up and just send this out? I think we'll do that, shall we? we? Just pluck yeah. out your answers from this. Everyone show. gets a little bit of. Do you miss the voice? I, I don't actually no. because I've been so busy in the Big Brother world yeah, that I haven't had not a on chance. your radar. Yeah, no. I get it. Yeah. I get it. I get it. That happens. Yeah, and I just Ooh. saw Amanda Amanda Keller. She was talking to me about Dancing with the Stars and oh, how, yeah, how they had to do show it with. That <laughs> do you like that show? You don't like that. You did that show too. Oh, you did. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. not your favourite then, obviously. <laughs> oh, no, I loved it. I, I well, you were truly dancer. loved it when we, were... we first started because yeah. it was a different time. There was no Twitter. There was no social yeah. media. Yeah. We wow. had no scripts. We did it without auto cue. That's right. Who it's was the host then? Daryl Summers. Oh, the greatest. Yes. That's right. Remember Darryl that? Summers. the Coca. He used to sing. He used yes. to break down the random songs. It was hilarious. So, He's great. What a yeah. great man and great presenter he is.